So, Canva Whiteboard. It's a great feature to use for brainstorming with your teammates or for collaborating with your colleagues. If you want to make your whiteboard more interesting and alive, what better way than to add animations to it? And that's what exactly we're going to talk about in today's video. So, let's get started. On our Canva homepage, we can see the whiteboard icon over here. Once you click on it, you'll be able to see different whiteboard categories you can choose from. They have several templates to choose from, and each template is set up according to its purpose to help you save time so you don't have to start from scratch anymore. Scroll down to get a better view of each template. Click the arrow button on the side to horizontally pan over other templates. See something you like? Click on it. But if you have other things in mind, then no worries. Unleash your creativity by making your very own whiteboard with your very own design. Go back to the top and click on Create a Blank Whiteboard. This will take you to another tab where you will see your blank whiteboard. And here we are. In case you change your mind, no worries. The Templates tab automatically displays on the side panel, so you can choose templates from there. They're usually on the Templates category. So, let's get started. Here on the whiteboard page, the most useful element is the sticky note element. That's why Canva created a shortcut for it. Just click S on your keyboard and a sticky note will immediately appear. Place it anywhere you want. You can add some elements by going to the Elements button on the side. Look for any elements you want to use on your whiteboard by typing in relevant keywords. Now. Let's spice things up and add some animation. Let's go to the Elements button again and let's type in Animation. And from the results, you can choose whatever types of animated element you'd like to incorporate into your whiteboard. But this is way too general. If you're looking for something specific, then it might be too time-consuming to look for it by continuously scrolling down. So if you're looking for something specific, try typing in relevant or specific keywords. Say, for example, in this case, it says deadline. So we're going to look for an animation that could catch your collaborators or a teammate's attention and make them know that something is urgent. Let's type in alert, for example. Choose an element and place it wherever you like. If you ever want to add animations as decoration, Feel free to do so by doing the same thing as we did earlier.
One of the best things about the whiteboard feature in Canva is that you can put in as many elements as you want because you have a very large workspace. You can even add more templates on the same whiteboard. I'm going to be creating a whiteboard, so if you want to watch my process and see how it's going to turn out, then keep watching. And here it is. That's all for today. 
Thank you for watching and see you in the next Canva tutorial video.